Tesla CEO Elon Musk has completely revitalized the electric car market over the course of the past decade. At the same time, he reclaimed space travel for the common man and revolutionized public transportation with his underground tunnel travel business, The Boring Company. So, having conquered land, space, and underground, it seems Musk is now turning his eyes toward the sky. Indeed, Musk has been teasing, in one way or another, his idea for an electric plane for nearly 10 years. He even made a cameo appearance in Iron Man 2, during which he quipped, I have a good idea for an electric jet. Entertainment aside, Musk has also made references to a battery-powered plane in more official settings, often noting that the concept becomes more and more likely as electric battery efficiency improves. During an episode of Joe Rogan's podcast in 2018, Musk flat out said that he'd been thinking about how to develop an electric plane for quite some time. He even highlighted some of the challenges he's been grappling with in bringing the idea to fruition. For example, he seems to be largely focused on creating a VTOL aircraft, which stands for Vertical Takeoff and Landing. This seems to imply that Musk's zero-emissions aircraft would be something akin to a Harrier or the F-35B Lightning II. Of course, both of these aircraft have fuel-powered engines that propel them forward. If a Tesla-produced plane, whether it's a true jet or not, were to move at any sufficient speeds, the transition from VTOL to forward flight would need to be solved without any reliance on jet fuel. It's also worth noting that Musk is not trying to come up with single-seater aircraft. This means that any popular mechanics fans anticipating the realization of the long-awaited flying car will have to put their faith in a different eccentric billionaire. When presented with questions regarding his electric plane ideas, Musk always reiterates that he is not interested in going small fry. But the biggest challenge Musk and his team of engineers face in bringing a battery-powered jet to the market is batteries themselves. Both Musk and his peers agree that any current battery powerful enough to support sustained flight would be too heavy to allow for a proper takeoff. For instance, right now Tesla's car batteries demonstrate a power to weight ratio of about 573 watt hours per pound. And while the Tesla research team has managed to theorize batteries that provide 793 watt hours per pound, sustained flight would require a minimum of 881 watt hours per pound. Though this indicates that Musk's team still has work to do to make a flying car feasible, it at least gives us hope that they're moving in the right direction. When asked outright, Musk places the timeline for a fully functional electric plane around three to four years. Depending on your overall eagerness for such a development, this will either seem like far too long or right around the corner. Of course, it's worth mentioning that there are plenty of barriers to overcome if a zero emissions plane were to be brought into production. A great example is the vast number of regulations and red tape surrounding the production of traditional fuel-powered aircraft. Were a completely new type of plane to be introduced into mass production for either private or commercial flight, the hold-ups, redesigns, and testing required would take years to complete, even if expedited. Then there's Musk himself. Despite having his hands in many different companies and projects, Musk still prefers to do much of the engineering and design work himself. And as a man who divides his time up into five-minute increments, it's not likely he'll be able to solve the problems of battery-powered aviation overnight. Though he definitely has members working on the overarching challenges, Musk's need for hands-on project management might do more harm than good. Another thing to think about is the actual need for an electric plane. While definitely useful, we need to consider just how little carbon emissions result from aviation. In fact, according to the Environmental and Energy Study Institute, air travel accounts for only 2.4% of global carbon dioxide pollution. Road travel, on the other hand, accounts for 72%. So, if Tesla's mission is indeed to save the environment by reducing overall carbon production, it would make sense for Musk to keep his focus on the road and his head out of the clouds for now. Clearly, Musk has an idea for a Tesla electric plane. From what we can tell, he has everything from sketches to blueprints to computations in place. He also seems to be committed to the VTOL path and is expending both manpower and brainpower on solving the challenges of electric flight. Still, we can't really make any presuppositions about what a Tesla electric plane would look like, how it would function, and when we would see one in action. Even so, we can always hope. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, then be sure to like and subscribe for more.